Okay. Let's see. Alright, now, um, it's not drawing all the way over, and we're not seeing the line at the bottom. Now, the line at the... The line at the bottom would be drawing, but it's exactly on the gray line. So what we need to do is just throw a minus one in there, just so it draws it one pixel um, short of that bottom line. Now over here on the side, it looks like we're actually the same size as one square. So I probably didn't put minus one when I was doing the look A variable. So here's where it draws it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. look A should be minus one. And then over here, look A minus one. When it draws the, here's the top left corner of that box, here is the bottom right corner of that box. Yeah, see I drew it on 40. Well the thing's height is 40. Now the very top would be 0, which means the very bottom should be 39. So I was slightly off. I was, I was uh, basically just off of the picture by one pixel. And see, when we load or run the program, it gives us a nice box. So, uh, what do I need to do next? Oh, we have to be able to scroll. So let's go into the actual um, let's go to the code for the picture. We have mouse down already in here, so we can select stuff. Now let's go to uh, key down. You should hopefully remember this from the Pac-Man video. This is how we controlled the guy. And if you uh, remember from that one, 37 left is the key to remembering the arrow keys. So we say if key code equals, and key code is up here, passes it to us, equals 37, that is that they've hit the left arrow key. So um, let's see here. We'll say look A equals look A minus 1. Call draw screen, call draw. No, you know what? I'm just going to say call draw screen, and from I am going to add into our draw screen the draw mini map, so we don't have to call both. No, all right, forget that. That's actually a bad idea because later on we're not going to have the editor anymore, or it won't be an editor, and we're not going to want it drawing a mini map that's invisible. It's just wasting effort. So we're going to do it the long way. Call draw minimap. Um, I should put an and in here. The reason is because if they're hitting the left arrow key, but you're already all the way slid to the left, you shouldn't be moving anymore because it's just going to take you off the screen. So we'll say and look a is greater than one. If that is true, it slides us to the left, and then. 37 is our left arrow, if you remember, it goes clockwise, so that means 38 is up, 39 is to the right. And look A is less than, this one would be kind of complicated, what you actually have to say is the map width uh, minus 1, but then you also have to take into account that there's a certain number of tiles on your screen, so you have to say, um, let's see, what would this be? is less than this it'd be integer of picture one dot width divided by forty plus one is, is how we've always been is how we've been doing it plus map width minus one so you know what we can take since plus one and minus one cancel each other out we might as well just take them out so that's it's ugly but trust me that's what it's supposed to be or okay don't trust me yet trust me after I run it and it works then you can trust me I probably shouldn't even trust me at this point um, so if they've hit the right arrow key and that condition holds true then look a is look a plus one cause draw screen cause draw mini map let's see if that works I have to put in something here we go I'll put in a couple of things okay now if I use the arrow keys, it's moving the minimap. See? See the minimap moving down here. But it's not changing anything up here. There's a reason for that. I don't have any code for that yet. So, when we draw a screen, which I need to find that draw screen, or draw tile, sorry, when we draw our actual tiles, we don't just draw them at. It, um, this is the only spot we have to change. This is where it's drawing it on the screen. We have to take into account that we may have slid. 
So we need to draw this minus look a, oh wait a minute, look a minus one times 40. Now we run it and I start drawing stuff in. When I slide, there we go, everything slides. Now, there's we're still missing some, now let's see if I can keep going left. Nope, I, it won't let me continue to go left, which is good. Now let's go to the right and see if it stops me before I go off the screen. Uh, no, it's that's glitchy, but it's okay if we're sloppy with that one. Let's, let's leave it for now. But the left code works, and that's the best one to have working right now. Uh, we're still missing something. See, if I click on spot, um, this is spot 1-1, one, one, and I click to make something, see, it draws it in spot 1-1. One, one. I'm going to erase it now. See, I have erased it. I'm going to erase a couple others just so that it'll be easy to see if that top corner fills in. Now, if I scroll over a few, and I click on this top corner, it, notice it's not drawing the box to show that it's selected, and there's a reason for that because I haven't draw I have not. Um, well, let me just show how this will work. If I hit land and I click, see, even though I'm way over here, th this corner should be right here. It drew here because that's the one that's still selected. Our selection code is not updated. So if we slide over, it's still just looking at this picture. If you are in the top edge corner of this picture box, that's spot 1-1. One, one. It doesn't matter how far you've slid. Right now, the code just thinks this equals 1-1. One, one. So let's change that. We go to our picture when we mouse down. Here we go. X divided by 140. I'm going to say X minus... Um, how should we? No, wait, 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 wait. Leave that as X. Plus 140 minus look A. Let's see if that does it. If I'm thinking of it right, that'll work. No, doesn't work. Let's try plus look A. Oh, you know what? I have to have minus. I keep forgetting that minus one. And they do cancel out, but yeah, I'm gonna leave it for now. Remember, it's always look A minus one whenever you see something. The brackets don't matter, but I'm putting them in so that you can see. It works when we're standing still, or when we haven't slid, so that's a good sign. It means we haven't broken what already worked. Now when I slide, if I click, ah, oh, it's gone crazy. See, it's drawing them over here, but my mouse is over here. So that's still not right. I'm going to go back to minus. Originally I thought that would work. Maybe it's because I had the minus one part left out. Now if I scroll, and I'm clicking, still not, oh wait a minute, wait a minute. I can explain why this is not working. We updated where it draws the these pictures. I never updated where it draws the, the box that shows you you've selected something. That's under draw tile. I should have changed that at the same time. See, I said minus look a minus one, right? We all remember seeing that. But I didn't do it down here. So I need to do that same thing. Um, minus this section, this whole thing, needs to go right here. And it needs to go, that's for one x coordinate. And then for the other x coordinate, it needs to go in. So now when I run it, this works. If I scroll, you can see that it actually, without me clicking, it moves like it's supposed to. And uh, clicking on new spots is not working because this was right the other way when I say um, mouse down. It's supposed to be plus. So if I scroll, I can continue to click. Actually, uh, it stops working right about here. That I'm not sure why yet. But we'll get to it. Oh, this is the edge of the map for some reason. See, it's like blurring and it's getting weird. Okay, anyways, uh, I'll figure that out. Things beeping at me. I think I might stop and get some food or something, so... Um, hopefully I will see all you guys. I know for you it's all instantaneous. You load the next video, you know, yay. But uh, for me it might be. 
certain amount of time. So, you know, hey, I might be back later today. I might be back tomorrow. I don't know. But I'll come back and fix, get this working the rest of the way. So, saving video.